What is up, everybody? Hungry Cabigon here. Today is a good day. It's new set release day. I have got Crimson Haze. I actually got two boxes. It was pretty easy to get. Um, so I was able to actually pre-order these, which is the first I've been able to do for a very long time. No lottery, just pre-ordered. Uh, I didn't know that they were going to cut the shrink wrap off, which is annoying, but it was from a card shop and they cut it off in front of me. So it's whatever, but we've got Crimson Haze. I haven't even had like a super good look at the set. I've seen like most of the SRs and stuff. I'm intrigued to see what we can get. Cards don't seem to be that expensive in this set. And I, I think it will be pretty easy to get. And hopefully this will be the new norm going forward. So the the most expensive cards are, are kind of like 10,000 yen, which is not too bad considering what we've had recently. So let's see what we can get. So Crimson Haze. Get into our first packs. Let's see if the print quality is better as well. We got a legendary straightaway to you. Oh, you know what? We've already, I can see, we've already got our ace spec card. I can see a pink glimmer back there. Cyber, what is it? Subaib Gipus. Subaib Gips. <laughs> what does that mean? So that's not the, the one you want to get is the, the kind of the reset stamp one. That's the best one to get, but that, we'll take that. So also the EV art rare seems to be quite expensive. So I guess that's the one you want to pull in terms of the art rares, but I want to get a special art rare if possible out of one of these two boxes. That's sick artwork. Um, but they're all pretty cool, honestly. I kind of like the... What is it? Sinistra? Is that what he's called? Or is it... I can't remember. In Japanese, it's called like Yabacha or something, isn't it? But he's pretty cool. The special art is pretty sick. They always are, though. They, all the special arts are very nice. Oh. We got the hammer back discard special energies with no coin flipping just get rid of them very annoying to deal with if you play special energies especially when you had that and the the regular hammers because you could just discard so many energies it was so annoying but i used to do it and annoy people <laughs> it was great we got switch all right switch is in here again i didn't know that they put switch in here again i feel like that will never go away so Although it does have G as the, um, the the letter on there instead of H. All right, so it feels like we haven't got much so far. Maybe this will be a pack where we actually get a hit. I think there's also a Snorlax card in this set, which I really want to get. Oh! All right, well, we got the Greninja SAR. I did not expect that so early. Oh, my God. Well, that is one of the good cards that I was talking about. That is sick. There is a lot going on there. I didn't know. Okay. Condition looks very good as well. Which has been a problem recently. It looks very nice. I was not expecting to get that so soon. Well, at all, but just... Well, that is one of the ones we wanted to get, so... <laughs> that is... <laughs> That is very nice. Good start. Good start. And I was just saying, we haven't even got like a hollow yet. What is happening <laughs> in this box? We already got our two one of cards for the box. Ooh, Eevee. That's kind of cool artwork, actually. Ooh, all right. And this is what I was talking about. There's a special art version of him, which is pretty cool as well. Yabancha. Not Yabancha. That was the old one. So what does his attack do? First one. Is that you discard a... No, for every grass energy in your discard, you can put two damage counters on your Pokemon. Is that what it says? I think so. And then they go back into the deck, maybe. Yeah. And then it's got another attack, 120, but heals itself 30. Interesting. Interesting. 
I don't really know what's like going to be good out of this. It's still a bit early. I just can't believe we got that Greninja, honestly. That's ridiculous. I'm very happy. <laughs> what a good start. All right, we got Lucky Helmet. Where is my Snorlax? <laughs> it's so stupid. It's like a, a common or uncommon, but I, I want him. Where is he? We should get him in a, a box. Boomerang energy. That's cool. I'm from Australia. I know about boomerangs. All right. I wonder if this will be a double hit box. It's been a while. We got a hit right at the start, though. More pickle. Oh, I the artworks are great, honestly. Recently, the sets have been killing it. Oh, nice. Got a little uh, Froakie. Little clay Froakie. Pokemon Catcher. Yeah, it's just... The, the most recent sets, just all the regular cards have great artworks, honestly. Not that they didn't before, but I just... I really noticed recently. Oh, it's a... Lubba Lubba Ball. Yeah, it's been, it's really been noticeable the last few sets. I just think all the cards are really nice looking. Lots of, ooh, Zapdos. Very kind of dynamic, uh, diff, I'm sorry, not dynamic. Very, I saw, I saw that one and I was like, it's very dynamic looking. Just a very interesting contrast of styles, which I always enjoy a lot. That was our first holo, by the way. We're like almost halfway through the box. Yes, Cabigon. All right, there he is. Nice. We'll keep you separate. I'm going to put you in a sleeve. That's so cool. Just for a regular card. So nice. Ooh, all right. And I, I totally forgot about art rares. All right, we got Cramorant. That's very cool. Kind of out of focus. I like that. So we want to get Eevee, I guess. That's the best one to get. In terms of the appearance of them, as always, they're all very nice, but I I don't know. I don't really have a favorite one at the moment. There's a lot of cool looking ones, so we'll take whatever we get out of this first box. Honestly, it's been very good already. All right, we got the helmet again. But yeah, we're very light on hits so far, I feel like. It's going to be a light on the other side of the box. Nice. Gardevoir and Gardevoir? Guardies. It's called Guardian in Japanese. So they uh Growlithe. Glaceon. Oh, that was the last card. Haha. <laughs> yeah, I get I got mixed up. Ga uh, Growlithe is called Guardi in Japanese, and I was like, it's a Gardevoir. No, that is incorrect. I like uh he's just called Dai Nose, Big Nose in, in Japanese. That's a great name. That's yeah, the arts are great. I really should analyze them more closely, but we gotta get through. We gotta get through a box. We've literally seen one hollow so far, which is crazy to me. All right, we might actually finally have a hit again in this pack. What do we got? Ooh, Makaga. <laughs> face. Oh my god. Yeah. So what does this do? So 140 plus 140 if you discard the top card of your deck, I believe that's what it says. And 70 damage and it burns the opponent. That's not bad. I don't know if there's going to be like a run on Macago decks, but you never know. Oh, there he is. Well, this is his pre-evolution. Oh, that's sick as well. The art style is so cool. It's very easy to just, like, gloss over. There's actually, like, a Japanese YouTube guy that I watch sometimes. And he opens, like... It's always, like, on, at midnight on the release day. And he has, like, a carton or two cartons. But he literally only shows the SRs. He doesn't show any of the other cards. And I just feel like... While the SR is the one that everyone wants to see, it's still, like, there's a lot of good cards in there. He don't, doesn't even show, like, the... Ooh, nice. All right. Doesn't even show the art rares, like, anything. So, it's it's kind of weird. I don't know about that. But he did open two cartons in ten minutes. So, it's, it's edited, obviously. But it's just, like, box one, we got this SR. Box two, we got this. 
it's it's interesting just to see like what the kind of the hits that you get out of a, a case is and stuff but it's it's kind of very base level like just i don't know it doesn't even look at the exes or anything so mm. it'd be nice <laughs> to be able to do that i guess to be able to open so many but yeah i don't know I'm sure lots more people prefer his style than my style, but, you know, we got our little niche audience, I guess. Oh, what is this? Oh, all right. We got Space Tyranitar. What does he do? So, it's, I think it says... Future Pokemon don't have an ability, I believe is what it says. And does one... Fifth, 140 damage and then you put one energy from this onto a bench Pokemon. Okay, interesting. But it is a basic Pokemon. No evolution required. Alright. What are we talking for the rest of the box? I feel like not that many more hits to come and we have a lot of packs, so let's get a I don't even know what we want to get for our last. I feel like we get one or two more EXs. Lots more hollows, definitely. One more art rare. Let's see, anyway. I hope we get a cool art rare, though. But who am I kidding? They're all cool, so. Let's put hollows over there. So, yeah, still only three hollows out. We got another Snorlax. All right, we'll put them separately. Is he a common? That's good for me. Ooh, all right. Is it up, Upland? I guess so. There's so many of them in the tree. I haven't even seen that one. That's cool. So, I'm happy with that. We can't complain, honestly. We got a ridiculously good box hit, so... You will not hear any complaints from me. Just interesting to see what we get for the rest of the box. And I have one more box after this, so... Not in this video. That will take forever, but we'll get there. It's the first time I've seen her. I don't even know what your name is in English. Sazare. There's a cool one, like the Growlithe is like looking in the camera lens and her SAR, she's taking a picture. It's kind of cool. I like that idea. It goes together. Eboi. Oh, all right. We got the Blood Moon. Earth Luna. Nice. Does 240 damage with five energy required, but uh, it's one of these ones. So for every prize card your opponent's taking, it it does one takes one less energy. So not bad to bust out like right at the end of the game. Or, you know, only need a couple of energy. You can do 240 damage, but you cannot use it on the next turn. I'd say that's more like a finisher, you know. Bust him out when your opponent's taken five prizes already. Zero energy attack, or like a four prizes, a one energy attack, and just annihilate something. That would be pretty good. Alright, what else are we talking for our last double apple pack? Nice. I feel like we got a few more hollows to come. We definitely... I can't believe how few hollows we've seen so far. And I don't know if we're going to get any other hits. It might just be all hollows for the rest. But you never know. We could get a double hitbox. Still possible. I believe. Ooh, walking away. That's cool. Alright. Maybe like two more hollows. And maybe... Maybe one more EX if we're lucky. Uh, no, no, it's the first time I've seen her. Sweet end. Her special art is interesting. It's kind of weird art style, but I, I kind of dig it. I think the normal full art might be even more popular, though. It's just, like, a normal image of her rather than some kind of... I was going to say cartoony, but it is a, literally a cartoon. Just a, a weirder kind of looking image of her. Oops, we skipped something. Apologies. We got Ting Lu, looking very scary. 
Alright, a few more packs. I feel like it's just all hollows at the end, which is kind of disheartening, just in the sense that it, I don't want to buy those bunch of packs. Oh, no. We got a double hitbox. I can see it. It's definitely... It's happening. Alright, what do we got? Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. Space Tyranitar, full art. Nice. It's been a long time. It's been a very long time since we had a double hitbox, honestly. In terms of regular full arts, I don't really know what's the best one to get. Just like the Pokemon, I think they're all kind of nothing particularly crazy or expensive or anything, but which one would we like to get? I don't know. I'm happy with that. That's cool. All right, well, what a nice box. We could have very easily only got one of them, so. And another Snorlax to finish it off. Yeah, I didn't expect to get a double hit box. It has been a long time coming, but uh, I very much welcome it. All right, what a great box. Let's have a quick recap of what we got. So, I'm sure that you didn't skip the video you watched the whole thing so you know exactly what we got but i'll just just in case yeah so we only got four regular exs because we got the the double hits that's okay that is totally okay and the i'm happy to report that the print quality seems a lot better so far uh we got our ace card which you can see is right there all right so we got hollows three four only five hollows in a box interesting all right the Ursula, we got Space Tyranitar, we got Macargo, we got the T, we got our Art Rares, I'm pretty happy with them, they're pretty cool. We got Double Hitbox, we got, da -da. I'm so happy with the Greninja, nice. What a good box to start off with. Anyway, we got one more to go. Let me know what you think anyway, guys. What are you chasing in this set? Check out the channel for more videos. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.